I'm so thrilled to be here from Darwin, mate. I'll tell you what, oh, I feel like I'm born to be here. My name's Richard Fiji. I'm a Larrakia man from Darwin. I'm also Wurramungu from Tanning Creek on my mother's side. Really proud to be here. So, let's take a moment to be serious now. Have any of you actually ever really had such a rough, bad night that you woke up the next morning next to someone really ugly? <laughs> I actually did that at Darwin once and, um, well, let me take, come with me on a flashback about 20 years ago. <laughs> so, brother boy lying back in bed, good way. Mm. Brother got some booty, brother got some booty. <laughs> oh, she's a beast. What I gotta do, I gotta get away from her, but I can't wake her up. So, looks like you're gonna have to do the deed. <laughs> no, I'm only kidding, and darn, we have Crocs. <laughs> so, what you do is you feel it around your bed, See if you can find a little croc walking around the bedroom. <laughs> yeah, got him. And you put him up there. Chomp, 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 chomp. Pull it off. Yeah, she's still asleep. <laughs> that was the easy part. The next part is getting out of bed without waking her up. So you're lying next to her and you're like, mm, okay. Brother got a slide. Rather get a slide, sliding on his back on the bed, and then that leg go off that bed like that, you know? <laughs> and then you gotta slide, and you come off that bed, and you squat next to that bed like that. And you don't wanna wake her up. You think, I gotta get out of the room. So you start going. <laughs> and then you hear something, and you stop, and you go. <laughs> and you look at the bed. Nah, nothing going on there. I'm right. <laughs> and then you get to the door and you close the, you open the door and you close the door and you walk in and you're in the lounge room and you go, oh, thank God I got out of that one. And you're thinking to myself, well now I've got to see what's on TV because it's not most time for my show. So I turn on the TV and my show's on. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Welcome to Black Views on Black News. My name is Deadly Brother, and on tonight's show, we have featuring local news. There are still no leads on the naked lady who robbed a bank in Darwin last week. Apparently, no one saw her face. <laughs> in national news, Aboriginal people from across Australia have taken to wearing bal balaclavas in their sleep. This way, at least if we're broken into and wake up, They'll think we're part of the team. <laughs> Religious groups in Western Australia have recently taken to taking the cross off their hot cross buns, so not to upset religious groups. <laughs> Aboriginal people from the region has responded with this statement. What the hell has this got to do with us? <laughs> Powerful stuff. <laughs> Law enforcement. Here at the Black News Channel, we would like to congratulate drugs for winning the war on drugs. <laughs> Weather. This week it's still going to be quite quarter cast, moving to a little bit half cast during the week. <laughs> Economics, we're still broke. This is Deadly Brother saying that if you would like any more follow-ups on the news, ladies, please feel free to um, email me directly at hotmail.hotmail.com. <laughs> or you can find me on Facebook under Big Boonga. <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, thank you. Richie Fidger.